had seen the It was about five minutes ago I'm back with another video and as you can tell by the title I'm gonna be doing some grocery shopping look at my new hair can you hopefully get to it yeah so I'm gonna look in here and see when you throw away see what I need look in here and see what I need and to throw away and then we're gonna hit like three different stores so, get you some of these, and just start on, start on some of these. How can us lose and miss the moment? You just too important. Nobody, nobody like you do. I can't. Bottles of water for five dollars. Oh my god. Yo, they got the ones that I like. Yes, sir. These are the ones right here. Bacon prices. What? Y'all need to come here because this meat is outrageous. They got Cloverdale. I mean, they had yeah, this one. Like, like what? Y'all, look at these prices for this these pork chops. Like, and they like thick too. Like, I'm probably about to get two of these. I'm not gonna lie. This one's five ninety four. Five seventy four. Have y'all ever seen Simply Lemonade for one ninety eight? We about to get about ten of these. <laughs> yeah, I didn't even notice Simply was one ninety eight. Oh my god! Then the big one is four twenty eight. How much is the big one? A lot more. Simply these the, the mini maids be the ones that be cheap because those are always one dollar. But these are like three dollars. Why are those one forty eight? Because they be going quick. Okay, so we're gonna get raspberry and regular. Yes. Berry punch and tropical punch. Basket getting a little heavy, y'all. I got this. I got them pork chops, like I told you, some sausage and some steak. So that's what we got so far. Okay, y'all, this is what we got from here. They are my favorite. Hold on, let me tell you. Mm -mm, I gotta go put this back. Yeah, it's only 2.30, bro. It's like 2.30. Oh, oh, fourth quarter? It's gonna take another hour. But yeah, that's what we got. So... Nah, bro, it's only the... It's five minutes left in the third quarter, bro. Five minutes... Going to Kroger. Let's see what we can spend. See what we can see. Why did I go in Kroger and meet my budget? <laughs> Look at all of this. I didn't even get this. Is the before? 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 They gonna be like, y'all didn't even need nothing for the freezer. <laughs> what for? This is all of the stuff. So 
So I just showed y'all how I organized everything and basically, but I'm gonna go ahead and tell y'all like the exact totals. So from, pull out my calculator. From Winco, we spent 132.47. So let me type that in. And then at Kroger, we spent 162.70. So plus 162.70. So in total, I spent $295.17. So for all of that food, that's how much I spent. So my biggest tips on being young and having all these, if you have help, of course, because I don't, yeah, I have help with paying the bills, but set for one, Set you, a, um, set you a budget. My budget was three hundred, so I was five dollars. You know, um, do the budget first. Try to research different stores. Like I found that Kroger. For one, I don't go to Walmart at all. Well, I go to Walmart for like little stuff, but like for fruits, like Walmart's fruits always have mold on it. Like none of their stuff is actually fresh. Like I don't really go to Walmart for food purposes. I don't really go to Walmart for food purposes. Maybe like to go grab something because we have one right over here. But find out which stores have like the, the most, the greatest deal. Like Kroger has good deals if you have a number. And Winco, I that's my first time going to Winco. Like that, you y'all, y'all seen the basket. $137 for all of that. Like their meat deals were outrageous. And the meats weren't like a little thin. Like they were thick pieces of meat like I got steak and pork chops um I didn't get no chicken because we had that's literally all we had in there before we went to the grocery store but yeah so budget find budget friendly stores like I'm gonna start going to Kroger and Winco um I used to do HEB but HEB is kind of pricey HEB is good on meats and, and um, I wouldn't say fruits because they their fruits aren't really cheap but their fruits are really fresh so I would recommend HEB, Kroger, and Winco, but Winco and Kroger for saving. Um, I really wouldn't get into all the Sam's Clubs and stuff like that until like you get like a bigger space. Or if you have like more pantry space, by all means, go ahead. Because I'm the type of person, I swear there's a lot of stuff in there for only two people. I'm the type of person that wants to um, stock up. Like I don't want to be without. You know, and if I'm about to spend money, like I want to, I would rather spend it all than to be going to the store for most of the little things. So last but not least, I would definitely say go old fashioned and get you a list because if you know you get this and you know you eat this all the time, just check and see what you need, check and see what you're running out of, write that down, and then just write everything else down that you normally would eat. So like fruits, the meats that you eat. Um, be looking up new recipes if you know it's closer to the time when you're going to go grocery shopping. Just little stuff like that. So budget, budget friendly stores and writing the stuff down. Those are my three biggest tips. That's what I use. Um, and just really finalize the list when you go over it. But yeah, so that's the end of this video. I hope you guys enjoyed because I like watching videos like that. Um, I'm just trying to think of different content I can get out to you guys. But yeah, that's in this video. So remember, if y'all rocking, I'm rolling. And that's on what? Period. Y'all have y'all a blessed evening. And like always, like, comment, and subscribe. And thank you so much for tuning in. Bye. I'm out of time. She's out the door. I gotta go for mine.